friends. Welcome to my channel. If you are new here, welcome back. If you are not, I am Keisha and I am here to plan for the first full week in October, October 2nd through October 8th. I am going to be using stickers that I made from clip art that I purchased off of Etsy. Um, and then I made these on my Cricut. Cute little ghosties. Okay. Um, I did use this on my monthly family planner. So if you want to see me use some of those stickers, then go ahead and go check that video out. But I made these in um, mine, like for the week in mind, um, the first week in October. Although it feels more fall and I probably could have ran with a really cute fall kit um, or kit or stickers. I just decided to you know, lean into the Halloween stuff. So I also am going to be pulling in some foil that I have from Scribble Prints Co. It is a silver bundle and it's a really pretty, just like flat silver, not matte. Uh, I thought that this would be fun to pull in. Just, I really had fun with uh, pulling in some of the icons and things like that for my last week's meetings. These are glitter headers. This is her old, old format, but it's just burning a hole in my in my uh, foil, so I might as well use it. So if you are interested in watching this week's plan with me, then just stick around. All right, day one of the week, Monday, October 2nd. So the very first thing that I have is I have a meeting. Um, every Monday we have the same meeting. So let's see, the meeting is pretty short, so I'm gonna go with like a smaller box. I'm gonna go with these half or like square boxes. They're so cute though, if you look, they're like the print of the actual scrapbook paper that I purchased. So these are little spiders on their, their string. So my first meeting is in the morning. Um, let me pull in my meeting sticker. So first meeting is the, actually a meeting, not a PLC, unlike previous weeks. So that's a staff leadership meeting. Then I have, I happen to be the PTSA rep for our school, just so that teachers don't have to leave like their prep period or their class. So this one is little stars. And this meeting is pretty lengthy. It's an hour and a half long. So I might not stay the whole time unless they absolutely need me to. Uh, that's a long time to have a meeting for me when I could really be in teachers' classrooms observing. Then my next meeting is a lunch meeting in, it's like 11.30 to 12.30, so it's like right here. I'm gonna pull in the cute plaid. So 11.30 to 12.30 right here. This one is a lunch. So I'm actually going to pull in some foil. Let's see, this one. This one doesn't have lunch date, date night. Okay, so let's see if there is an icon that I can use. So she has like a couple different icons. I don't know where we're eating, but it might be kind of fun to put in one of these icons since I'm probably not going to use it any other time. Oh, and the wind is starting to pick up. It's like a really windy day. Mm, let's do the sushi, that's kind of fun. I don't, again, I don't know where we're going to lunch, but man, sushi would be good. All right, and then that's it for Monday. Um, let's add in some stars. These are kind of cut weird a little short but that's okay so we've got one meeting it's kind of fun to decorate i mean i have so much foil that i never use and 
I need to use it because I purchased it, so might as well. So if you have never watched my videos before, what I do is I put in my meetings first, all of like my scheduled stuff very first, and then I decorate just so that I am not losing my planning ability because of all the decorating that I'm doing. Okay, it's hard to see because it's it looks flat, but like when you get a good light on it, oh yeah, so pretty. Okay, let's get some decorations in. So I've got these clear spooky ghosts, which would be fun, but these pumpkins are also really cute. This week is gonna be full of pumpkins. Like I'm probably gonna be so sick of pumpkins, but that's okay. So these were actually individual pumpkins and I, sorry, lost my train of thought. I took them and I welded them together. It's something that you can do on the Cricut. I'm gonna take these stars and go down the center. Got a couple different colors of stars. I think I have a blue star. There's a light blue star. Okay. Uh, I think I'll add the orange back in. Down here at the bo bottom, like that. Okay, so now I'm gonna come in and I'm gonna add some more of these gems. I'm gonna call them gems, but they're just like these little stars, which is great because there's stars in all of these. They don't need a star on every corner, but kind of fun to add a little glitter. Okay. Really need like needle nose tweezers for these. Okay. Let's see. Oh, I also printed this, these to-dos to go on each of the days so that I had like a cute little to-do that went with it. Okay, that's perfect. All right. I think I'm gonna take these. These are headers. And they're actually, I think they're half cut headers. Yeah, they are half cut headers, which is perfect because that means that they're thinner, like a line. And I can put them right on this line right here. So it's like glittery in between the stars. I need to make sure that I put an extra one there. I mean, why not? Um, I, again, I'm, I can't take this stuff with me when I die, so I might as well use it. Why hoard it? Okay, I'm gonna get my precision cutter. I gotta get really close. So if you see my brain, I'm sorry, my noggin. Oh, this, it's like plastic, so it's really hard to cut. It's like I'm more likely to cut the paper than I am to cut the actual we go okay we'll put this right here and then I'm gonna cut this one in half so that I can place some right here and at the top okay this one's right here and this one's at the top All right, um, I mean, I didn't go as creative as I have been on some of my deco. I wonder if I should pull in some more of the pumpkins. Maybe do it over here on the sidebar. Like, but then I'd have to re-punch them. I didn't, nope. I don't wanna re-punch them. Maybe I'll do it over here. 
That way I can just cut off whatever doesn't you doesn't work. I have orange ones somewhere, but oh, they're up here. Oh well. Let's do blue for now. I think one, no, not one more. So put this around. I think I'm good. I just don't want to like overwhelm it. I wonder if there is a washi that I can pull in that is like Halloween or something. Oh wait, no, I just recently looked at my washi. washi. I don't have any. So this one is leadership and it's at a 20. This one is PTSA and this is 9 to 1030. Again, I don't anticipate being in that meeting the whole time, but yeah. And then lunch with one of my coworkers. Her name is Anne. And that's 11.30. And yeah, Monday is gonna be a nice and chill day. I need to work out this day, so I always put, or if I put a reminder, then I'm more likely to do it. So I'm gonna put one of the boxes down here at the bottom and I'm gonna put that I need to work out. I have these, these are also from Scribble Prints Co. This is more of a sparkly glitter, sparkly hollow maybe, but or sparkly silver. But I, oh no, yeah, I just put workout all in. But you know, can't have something in every single shade of foil. But I like it. Cute. Nice and simple. A little quiet compared to my other uh, days that I have done. Okay. Let's get on to Tuesday. Tuesday is a little bit more of an exciting day with more meetings. So we're going to start with the to-do that I made. Okay. So I have a meeting here. Meeting here, meeting here, meeting here. Then we have things after school. So, there's one, two. I want them to be like different enough, but also, oh no, this is 43. Glad I didn't put that down. Like, I, I didn't have a ton of scrap of paid pages to work with. Um, I've actually bought this last year. I like to make my presentations for my teachers um, with fun background slides. So that's what I bought it for was like a meeting for my teachers last year. So I'm using it for my planner this year. Why not? Two birds, one stone. All right, then this night... My husband has a class kind of thing. It's called Way to Health. He's been doing it for almost a year now. We're actually getting to the point where he's almost done with it. But it's in preparation for his um, bariatric surgery. And it is on the computer. So we'll do one of these computer ones. So Dave has that. And then Layla has gymnastics and so I'm gonna pull in this pink little box it's not too big but it's it's fun a lot of pink on this page and I'm gonna use one of the little bandits from print petticoat bandit it's a little gymnast we'll do it right here and then I have this script from Planahanna, and it is glitter hollow as well. I'm gonna just place that right there, Layla. So I need to pull in PLC stickers for each of these meetings. These ones are actual PLCs, not just a meeting. 
PLCs, I'm going to say this every week, stands for Peer Learning Community. It is usually the teacher that teaches the same thing as you, just for a different team. So like if I taught sixth grade social studies, then they would be the other sixth grade social studies teacher for the other team. We do a lot of teaming for our school. So actually for our district, it's a really big thing. So my meetings for Tuesday include... ELA 8, for almost an hour, Math 8, again, for, this one's actually 45 minutes because it is also during their lunch time. This is Science 8. And this is Social Studies 8. This is my 8th grade team. And you'll see on Wednesday, I'll do 7th grade, and Thursday, I will do 6th grade. Layla has gymnastics at 6 p.m. And my husband has Way to Health from 6.30 to 8. So I will take the kids to, to gymnastics, which is fine. I can do that. He had to deal with being a solo parent this week while I was at conferences. So that's just how parenting works. All right, let's pull in the decorations aspect of these stickers. I think I'm gonna do something down the center again. Um, I have a lot of these like bundled stickers. Oh, maybe I'll do the spooky. Pull in the ghosts. Oh, like every time I pull my hand up, it focuses on my hand, which is cool, but also not necessary. Ghosty, ghosty, ghosty. Oh, come on, lift. I think I could fit one more. I haven't actually pushed them down yet. So, but I will. And all I'm going to do to push them down. Oh, oh no. Oh, thank goodness. Um, I was going to use a ruler, but I think I'm just going to carefully go over them. I'm still like new to the clear, clear sticker thing. So just, yeah, got to be careful. Okay, I have this cute happy Halloween. I know it's not Halloween, but like it's Halloween time. Why not? Why not enjoy what we have here for the month? We'll do this boo. And then I'm gonna take these orange pumpkins and line them up against the bottom because I feel like what's more Halloween than orange pumpkins? I don't know, because the other pumpkins are cute, but they are more of a newer thing, like the other colors and stuff. I know that like if you have that teal color, it means that you have candy that is like safe for allergies and stuff like that, which is kind of cool. Not that I've ever had to deal with allergies, let alone getting pumpkin, like getting candy that is like that, but yeah, it's cute. Um, I think I'm gonna do, some bats just like coming off the page I haven't laid them down entirely yet Put this over I'm getting better at cutting the stickers on the other side instead of cutting the paper which is awesome okay I think I'm going to do some more bats down here. It just seems kind of plain. So, one bat, two bats, and three bats. Oh, we don't want it over gymnastics, but we'll put it down here. Okay, that's cute. Tuesday is done. Let's move on to Wednesday. 
Wednesday, I have a very full schedule, just like Tuesday. But instead of eighth grade, I'm meeting with seventh grade. So let's pull in the to-do sticker. Okay. I like having the to-do sticker, that's fun. I think before I put down my boxes though, I'm gonna pull in some big pumpkins and I am gonna put them like all along the center. Too bad I don't have like them in different orders. That's okay. This is still usable day. That's the best part about this is that it still says, hey, I can use this. Um, let's see what we can pull in. I think I'm gonna pull in, so I have these like, these are bougie boxes or overlays, depending on who you are, what shop you are coming from. I am going to actually cut them because they are in rectangle form and I'm going to cut them so that they're like following the pattern. Oh shoot. Yeah, there we go. And then I'm going to put them on the pumpkin. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. You can kind of see it from your perspective like I can, but honestly, it's just gonna take a little bit of time for it to settle in, but once it settles in, it'll like blend in. Blend in actually very nicely. You can just see it because of your lighting, the way that the lighting is sitting. Like you can kind of see where the end, and this is done. Just a random sticker. Um, I'm gonna do something similar for this. I think I'm gonna cut, so this is a full header box. I'm just gonna try and cut it wiggly, but I don't think I have the skill to do that. Let's see if I can. Like, curved, curved, curved a little bit. So it's not so straight. Okay, don't love this hang off right here. So I'm gonna just clip on that a little bit. So now we have a little bit of glitter in each of the sections. I'm gonna pull in those little star stickers and place them in some of the other parts of the pumpkin area. So the top. Oh, I'm gonna have to sit down for this. Normally I do sit down when I plan, but I just like making sure that I'm in frame and that I'm not being called. But actually I think my, my phone is on, is not on silent. Normally it's on silent. And so like if somebody calls in, I don't know uh, when it's happening. And so it might cut off. I guess I could know because I have my watch on, but Nonetheless, I don't like being cut off. Just like, I wanna film a video without somebody interrupting me. But, mom never sleeps, right? <laughs> I'm, uh, today is Friday, October, or I'm sorry, September 30th, 29th, September 29th. So tomorrow's the last day of September. Um, I actually have today off because we had teacher conferences this week and although I do not teach any students I didn't have to do any parent conferences I if I want today off like the teachers I need to be there so I ended up just helping teachers out in different ways a lot of it was like day two with my zoom link or with zoom links because we did virtual on our second day and some parents just some teachers too. They, you would think that teachers would be like pretty tech savvy, but man, there are some that are pretty not. <laughs> trying to be nice, I'm trying to be diplomatic about it. But 
yeah I'm happy that that's over but it's nice to have the day off my kids went to school because they are not on the same schedule that i am um so i got to go to zumba this morning and enjoy the start of the weekend all right i think i want to add some of the stars in so we'll add a star here i wish i had a fall quote but i don't think i do and i don't really want to go scour for one i probably will come up empty anyways so yeah it's one of the reasons why i don't want to little bit of hangover on this one all right let's put in our appointments and stuff for Wednesday just so that we can get those out of the way so I have a meeting first period I have a meeting second period I have a meeting fifth period And I have a meeting seventh period. And I don't think we have anything after school this day except for I have Zumba. So I'm going to put in this pink box. And I'm gonna pull in that workout sticker from Scribble Prints Co. that I used on Monday. I probably won't get the chance to work out on Tuesday, so um, yeah. That's it. And then, so these are all PLC meetings. So we'll do PLC one, two, three, four okay this is math seven from 805 to 855 this is social studies seven from 9 to 955 it's the whole period time if you can tell this is ELA 7 from 1220 to 110. And this is Science 7 from 210 to 3 o'clock. Zumba is at 730. And something that I did not add in for this day that I need to is that Layla has early release on Wednesday, if I can find my early release sticker. Wednesday, early release, which means that she is released at 12.30. So we'll put that right here. My mom will pick her up. She loves going to my mom's house on her Wednesday early outs because they craft. It's so fun. We've got some cute crafts in our house. Okay, Wednesday's done. On to Thursday. Thursday, again, after school, I have nothing going on on Thursday. This is going to be such a chill week. Nothing going on on Thursday. Let's pull some of our deco in. And I also need to do this to-do sticker. So cute. All right. I think I'm going to pull in... I have some of these mini pumpkins. I think I'm gonna pull in some of the minis mixed with the medium sized ones so that it ha it's like really busy in the center right here. One, two, three, um, actually I might just stick with mini. One, two, three. Okay. 
And this day is actually, so we have an angel baby. Uh, we, in 2014, I was pregnant and at 22 weeks, we had to deliver our angel baby uh, because I was so very sick, like I almost died. So this is our angel baby's birthday because 22 weeks is not a viable lifetime for babies and so we have her buried actually at a cemetery that was really that is really close to our house it just so happens that we moved here recently well within the last two years and it's right by where she's buried so we're very lucky in that sense um, not everybody has the opportunity to live near where their loved ones are buried so this is her birthday, and usually what we do is we um, get her something for her grave and celebrate her in the afternoon. Oh, that is a little crooked. Oh, good job. Her name is Reese. And she was stillborn. So we are very lucky that we have her looking down on us. Um, that is too big for that. So we'll do kind of that same bundle, but different colors in different order. Okay, you know, I think that's probably it for this day only because I wanna keep it pretty simple. I do wanna pull in some bigger, I mean, she has, so I have these bow washies that we could easily pull in for the bottom. And actually I might do that. Okay. That's cute. I like that. And then I want to put in, so these are cute little footprints. I thought that that would be a good representation for our little, our little angel baby. And maybe a ribbon for her. And then these three, I'm gonna put these cute thin bows on them. Just fun deco, very dainty. They kind of look like they have mustaches. <laughs> oh, that's cool, look, it looks like it's gold. The way that the light is hitting it. It's like a shift. Okay. Um, I think I'm going to pull in, this is a full washi of stars at the top, so it looks like stars are falling. I think that's cool. And put it right on that line. So it seriously looks like stars are falling. Okay. So let's put in my meetings. I have a meeting. Um, first period. PLC. I have a planning meeting with a teacher. It's not a PLC, it's just a regular meeting, second period. I'm helping her. She's teaching a new content this year and she just is really struggling. And so that's where I come in to help support her in any way that I can that she needs. And so she needs help with uh, doing like a scope and sequence or essentially a plan for her um, class that she's teaching so and then seventh period this week is nice so I'm going to get a lot of observations in and I think I'm gonna put another to do over this because it's kind of blocked so why not why not it's cool all right so let's get those scripts in get myself organized a little bit so 
The second period one is an actual meeting. And then the other four are PLCs. One, two, three, and four. That page is done on PLCs. Three, four, five, five meetings on this day. Okay, so first period is social study six, 805 to 855. This is with a particular teacher from 9 to 9.55. This is with Science 6 from 10 to 10.50. And this is ELA 6 from 10.50 to 11.40. And this is math six from 210 to three. I think the only thing I need to add in is that I do want to work out this night. I'm running low on these box stickers. In fact, these are my last two. So I'm gonna pull in a pumpkin. Let's pumpkin it right here. And then I will pull in a workout from Scribble Prince Co. This is great okay i don't have a planned workout this is just me going to the gym all right done with thursday all right so friday i'm gonna put in i only have two meetings this day um one is fourth period i think yeah fourth period this is like shorter periods, and so if I were to do it by time, then what is this normal time on a Monday through Thursday schedule would be completely thrown off, just so you are aware my mind, where my mind was when I just did that. Like, what? But, okay. Um, then, after school, I have a couple meetings. Um, so we will put that there. Um, I know I have more PLC stickers, but I'm not going to pull them out. I'm just going to use meetings. So I have a meeting, PLC meeting here. And then I actually have two meetings in this time. So I'm just going to do it like that. And this one is a SPED meeting. from 1040 to 1110. And then this one, first I have a meeting with PE and Health from 130 to two. And then we have what are called animal teams. When I said we do a lot of teaming, this is what I mean. Is uh, animal teams are based off of the same grade, and uh, well, you teach one grade and the same set of kids. So you have a math, science, social studies, and ELA teacher on that one team, and that team teaches all of the kids um, on that team. So there's no like mix up. I finished some, a script page. All right, let's pull in some pumpkins. I think I'm gonna do a lot of layering on this one. So I'm gonna take these and I'm gonna do like size, okay? I only have one petite sticker left, but I can always pull in other stickers to stack them. Come on, come on, there we go. And right there. Then I will pull in this little tiny petite one that I have left over from that center. Okay. Then I'm going to pull in I think I'm going to pull in up here 
I'm gonna pull in this Happy Halloween. It's kind of like a smiley face, doesn't it? If it were clear, I would have put it down here, but can't win them all. Down here, we'll put Boo. And we'll put a star. Okay. Up here, I think early on in the day, we'll do some pumpkin stacking. All right, that page is gone. I'll pull in some of the clear stars from the clear paper. Again, I'm still kind of learning how to use my clear paper, but I'm getting there. Slowly and sure, but surely I'm starting to have more confidence in it. Okay. I think, I think I'm gonna put some pumpkins right here. Put one like right here. Put one like right here. Lots of pumpkins, kind of evenly them all out. Um, let's see if I can lift this up. Oh, I can put that right there. So it looks, it's like consistent. Okay. Busy, but cute. Friday is done. Saturday. The only thing that I have is Zumba on Saturday. And and that's it. So Zumba. And I'm going to pull in an icon. Let's do... Is there a, it's not a fancy one. Let's see if there's a better workout one here. Hmm. These are not great workout ones, but that's okay. I'll pull in the running man guy. Like the universal sign for running. This day, I'm going to do a lot of stacking at the bottom. So we'll start here with this big one. Actually, I'm going to cover that. Okay, and then I'm going to come in with more of these and I need to cut this. Right here. So I don't have to actually do anything with that. And then right here, oh, that's almost perfect. Just trim this off a little bit, just a little crooked. Okay. And we'll pull in the last of the ghosty. Come on, ghosty. It wasn't cut very well. And I think I have one more boo. Would be fun to put boo next to him. All right, let's see. Let's throw that away. Add a star in so that I can throw this one away. No need to keep the extras if I don't need to. Ooh, let's add some bats in. Maybe coming up from the pumpkins. have a couple more pumpkins on this page so I'm gonna stack down here I know that it might not be necessary but I'm gonna do it anyways 
And then we'll add a light one right here. Okay, that page is done. And I think I'm probably good. I might add a couple more stars. We don't have any Utah games this week, so it'll be kind of a quiet week. Maybe we'll go to, we have a theme park here that does like a fun Halloween activity. So maybe we'll go there. I bet the kids would love that. Okay, I'm gonna show you what I have left of this kit that I created, or I guess stickers that I created. I have a lot of big boxes left, which is great. Lots of deco left. So I just usually take this to school and I decorate my big calendar with it. So that's the nice thing about those. Um, Here's what I have left of the silver stickers. I've got a lot of these. I like to kind of play around with this through the week. So what I do is I'm gonna put this um, at the front of my planner so that if there's anything that comes up that I'm like, I really wanna decorate this, then I'm gonna decorate it. It'll be kind of fun. I always just like put extra stuff in here. So, I, and it fits perfectly at the front of my planner. So yeah, let me get this organized, put back in my planner and I will be right back. All right, we are back. Um, again, this is for the week of October 2nd through the 8th. So let's go through each day. We have Monday, kind of quiet. I noticed that my Mondays are always kind of quiet and then they like ramp up for a more decorative week. I like the glitter that I added into here. Very fun, I'm loving the top and bottom washi with the glitter. Friday, I like this stack. It kind of looks like something that you could put like on a mantle or something. And then Saturday, Sunday, so yeah. If you like this video, do not forget to like, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and I hope you guys have a wonderful week. Bye guys.